Saturday, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope everyone's having a really good day and in today's video we are going to be talking about Google Chrome extensions. So in this video I'm going to be showing you guys eight must-have extensions for every student. So the thing is that most people aren't aware of these useful resources and these extensions but trust me they deserve all the recognition. I've been using these extensions ever since I was in my middle school so I think I have pretty much the grasp on like what to expect and you know what to use. So, so before getting into the video I must tell you guys what are exactly Google Chrome extensions. So basically Google Chrome extensions are a small program which helps you modify your experience on the web browser and they help you with your productivity level. They help you do few tasks super easily and you don't really have to make much effort. Ever since COVID happened and everything got online and we have been like using our devices more than we have been using books. So in that case, these become so handy. You know, they just make your work easy. They're more convenient. So let's get on with the video. I have my computer here with me and I'm gonna... Oh, what? And I'm gonna show you guys my extensions and the ones I use. And I'm... So the first extension that I'm gonna be sharing with you guys is gonna be Dualness. So what is Dualness? It's basically a handy tool which helps you split your screen into whatever ratios you want let's say you're attending your class at the same time you want to make notes so obviously you won't switch between tabs like that you can attend your class at the same time you can make notes so what you need to make sure is that you must be signed into your chrome account with the one you want to work on so you will directly go to the google web extension and then you're gonna open it there you can search all the extensions that you want so after you have added it to your chrome extensions on the top bar on your right hand side a symbol will appear where the extension is being added and you can go there and access it the second extension that i have for you guys is dictionary all over so this has been like just so useful to me lately because i've been using it like every time i open my computer browsing on your web and you're reading an article and all of a sudden this word comes in between which hinders you from reading and you have to go to another tab to search the meaning or you have to open your phone to search the meaning but i got a solution for you so all you need to do is highlight the text and and the meaning is gonna appear right on the spot which is like so helpful and so amazing that it just sorts out my problem of switching between tabs to search for the meaning. I click on the word and the meaning is going to be there right in front of you, I think, which is an amazing tool. And most of the people are not aware about it, but now you are. The third extension that we have is actually a dark mood. All this time, all this year, we have been so occupied with devices all around us being laptop and it's really important to take care of your eyes. So this dark mode actually helps you turn your entire uh, browser and the screen that you're using on the browser into a darker version. This is very beneficial, especially when you're using the screen at night. So next up we have is this little cute app known as Forest. So Forest is basically a productivity app. It's this little cute thing in the corner. It's sort of a Pomodoro timer. And you know what, guys? So basically it's the thing with each one of us that we get so much distracted, like in between studies. We want to open YouTube or want to go to Netflix or watch Prime or whatever. And it's just a lot of loss of focus so what this does is that it restricts you to visit any other tab after you have put on the timer so it won't allow you to switch between tabs and that is something which is going to keep you focused and you know concentrated on your work it plants a tree when you put on the timer and you don't want the tree to die because why would someone want this cute little tree to die it's just as simple as that and i pretty much use it on my phone as well as on my laptop and to me it is really helpful and i 
definitely suggest it to you guys as well. Up next we have is Momentum. I guess Momentum is something which is most hyped up out of all these extensions and yet many people do not know about it. Momentum is a tab which replaces your normal Chrome tab. So this basically offers you to make a to-do list and you can check it off when you're done with your tasks for the day. And you can also check the weather for whichever place you want to know the weather of. And it also shows up a new quote every single day. Next extension is the one which I've been using all this time I've been shooting this video. So it's basically the screen recorder. So let's an extension which helps you to record your screen on the spot. It basically isn't that that helpful. But yeah, it does come handy at times and I think it's a good extension to add up to your extension list. Second last extension that I have for you guys, water reminder. You know, we've just been sitting in front of screens all day and I've been like spending time on screens that we actually forget to hydrate ourselves. So we set after how much time you want to be reminded. So let's say you want to be reminded after 15 minutes to drink water so it's going to remind you to drink water after 15 minutes okay guys so the last extension that we have is this extension known as mail tracker so it's basically and specifically for gmail so what it does is that it shows you a double tick whether a person has read your email or not let's say you're texting a very important person and you, and you want to know whether they read your email or not i think this is a super super helpful option okay guys so that was it about this video i hope you found this helpful in one or the other way and these were only few extensions that i use so i actually have a lot of extensions that i use and if you guys like this video and want me to make another video i'll definitely do that but thank you so much for watching till the end and i'll see you guys the next time bye bye